Okay, I'm going to bring to you another couple of knots. Uh, the first one is going to be a dropper loop. And the second one is actually going to be a bobber stop knot. For the dropper loop, what you want to do is take your line. Make it into a circle. You got the two lines up top. What you want to do is just twist them. Six to eight times will be fine. Reach through there, the little loop that you just made. Grab your main line, bring it up through, and just start drawing it down. Again, this is going to be way easier with monofilament than boot lace. Just pull them. And that'll make your loop. You can also join two lines together with this. What you want to do with two lines is take your first line and your second line, bring them, bring them together like this, just tie an overhand knot with both of them, This here, this here knot's just to keep the two lines together is all. And then, what you would want to do is make your loop up above the knot here. Make your six to eight winds with it. Then bring that uh, overhand knot right up through them. Like so. Draw it up. And then you can just cut your loop here off. That's a 100% strength knot. So, well, 90 to 100. So that will hold pretty good. Okay, for the bobber stop knot, I know my lines here are the same color and everything, but you'll get the general idea. What you want to do is you want to take a 6 to 8 section piece of... Uh, kite string or I use the uh, yellow 50 pound test um, braided fish line for ice fishing. What you want to do is you want to take it, make a loop, set it down onto your main line. It doesn't matter which tag in you start with, just uh, as long as you start with one of them. Take it and just start wrapping it around through the bigger hole here. Then uh, grab both of your tag ends and pull at the same time. What that will do is make a knot. And what you do is you take your, both of your tags, cut them off, and that is a slip knot so that will slide up and down your fishing line for you to adjust your bobber height. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed these. I I am definitely uh, going to do a couple more in this series. And don't forget to rate and subscribe. Thank you.